What's up, guys? I'm out here in my kayak for the first time. Just kind of giving it a little maiden voyage. Uh, I had some repairs to make on my trailer to haul it. The wind is blowing. Stupid. <laughs> and I have no anchor, so it's kind of tough. Um, definitely gets blown around a lot. But. I think uh, it's gonna be great there. <clears throat> so I used to I used to kayak fish from a uh, an Ascend FS12. I'm a big guy. Uh, I've been struggling with my weight for uh, most of my life that I can remember. So and just recently uh, got some answers as to why. Uh, other than just bad diet, you know, you try so long. Anyway, but I'm heavy, and uh, I'm fighting it. I try to stay active, but I had to have a kayak that could support me. It's like I got light. I got lighter one time. I lost some weight, and uh, my ascend uh, was great at the moment. But when I started gaining weight again, it caused me issues. So I began to. I, I sold it. <laughs> I got rid of it. I had really told myself that uh, I was done with kayak fishing, which I should have known. I should have known that that was ridiculous, to say the least. Because I really love being out here. Um, I'm at. If you don't recognize the location, if you're not from around here, I am at a place called Haskell Point Boat Launch. Um, it's just one of the farthest south boat launches there is, and there's just a little lake uh, just north of it. I've never fished it. Uh, I literally just uh, took today off, and uh, I woke up this morning and got to thinking about my trailer and I, I, what I had to do to it to get it to where I could haul this kayak down here. And I jumped outside and I knocked that out. And, loaded up so here we are uh, because I haven't put this kayak in the water and I have had it since uh, late fall I want to say of last year I've had it for a while uh, just haven't had any time well I put it in the pool once but that can only tell you so much because it's perfectly still water uh, my most of my kayaking is going to be close to uh, it's going to be in salt water, brackish water. Water's not always going to be still. So, it's something I had to, uh, I got to take into account. But, I don't know, just out here today, just kind of chilling and enjoying it. Uh, I didn't really come prepared to fish. I, I grabbed a couple of things and, and one rod. And that was it. Uh, it's a horrible time of day. It's like, it's like one o'clock. Uh, if I come back out here late in the evening, I'll probably have better luck. But right now, the sun's almost straight up. Uh, yeah, almost. So, water's going to be hot. Fish are probably trying to find a cooler place. And this is not deep water. So, uh, I see some folks over here catching something. I'm going to go over here and check it out see what it is. Be right back.
peeps. I'm going to wrap this up. I know it was a short, quick, simple video. I didn't catch anything on what I was using. I met a, a great family at the uh, at the dock. Uh, I'm horrible with names, guys. So if you're watching this, I apologize. I've got you. I've got Mike's card. Uh, the Fondrens just moving down here. So first off, um, I want to congratulate you on getting closer to the water. It seemed like you guys love the water. Uh, but no, I met this great family. Uh, they were really, really nice to me at the dock. I was really trying out the kayak. Uh, didn't come prepared to fish well. <clears throat> they had some shrimp, popping corks. They handed me a rod and boom, I caught a dink red. Uh, thought I had the camera rolling, but I didn't. Uh, I think I turned it off while I was talking to them. Uh, I don't know why I did that. But anyway, <laughs> but I did. Um, anyway, so. The kayak's pretty awesome. Uh, the trailer's gonna work. I might get another trailer. I have another, uh, I have somebody else told me earlier today that they had a jet ski trailer. So I may actually uh, get that and use it to be a little narrower. Uh, but this one really works pretty good. I could make two, a double kayak out of this one. But all right, let's wrap this up. Bonafide SS127, um, heavy duty kayak. I was a little wobbly in it, but it was me when the kayak. I never flipped over. I never really thought I was going to flip over. It's just my bad back, my weak back. Um, every time I'd lean to one side or forward, it's just, just awkward. Um, I did the same thing in the ascend, and toward the end, I was moving around it pretty well, getting in and out of it. Once you find the groove, it, it's a lot easier. But all in all, it did pretty well. Yeah, I got pushed around by the wind, uh, like a lot of people complain. But I should be able to fix that with an anchor system, you know. Um, if I can throw an anchor down. But one time, I, I, I got a rope on the bow. Um, and there was a pipe sticking out of the water, and I just threw my rope over that. And then when I was talking to uh, the Fondrins at the dock, um, I threw my rope over the, the dock pole. And, yeah, I was able to sit still. So that worked. Uh, but like I said, it, I was a little wobbly. But it, that'll get better. That, that'll come with time. That, that is the first time that I've ever been in it on the water. And like I said, I'm a big guy, so real top heavy. And I had the seat on the highest setting. Uh, so I'm sitting way above the water. So if I were to lower it down, it'd be a whole lot more stable. Never really felt like I was going to flip. Uh, definitely didn't feel like what the uh, Ascend FS12 T. Uh, it always felt like I was uh, sinking. And so, okay. But all in all, it was great. Um, appreciate it, Fondrins. Let me use some shrimp. I gotta check out of here. Peace. Almost forgot one thing, guys. One of the most important things of the weekend, and that is snapper season 2019, tomorrow. And you're like, Wes, why are you so excited about snapper season? Because I didn't get to go last year uh, at all. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm correct about that. I just didn't get to go fishing. I didn't get to do it a lot. I love to fish. So that's a big deal. So bonafide kayak, thumbs up. Hopefully I'll get some video the rest of the weekend. We'll have some snapper showing and I'll have some snapper in the, on the grill. Appreciate you guys, all of you. Wes out.